All right, just coach, uh, start with your, your overall thoughts on the game today. You know, what a turnaround a week made. Um, you know, we were really disappointed with our performance at Bucknell in every phase of our game except the goal last week. And uh, we had a short week, only four-day practice week. Um, really went after them physically, mentally, and emotionally to turn this thing around. You know, that was not the team we saw in the preseason at Bucknell. And we had to right the ship and do it quickly against our in-state rival. You know, a team that's beat us the last two years in a row. Uh, a team that is really tough physically. You know, kind of a mirror image of us. And, uh, and, and to play that well and that hard in a game we had to have tells me a lot about our group. You shut them out in the third quarter, a huge momentum changing quarter. Just your thoughts on that quarter for your team. I told them in the locker room the game will be decided in the third quarter. You know, we're up one. I said, I've been there, I've, you know, coached lacrosse 36 years, you know, the first five minutes of the third. And, you know, the, uh, it was a 3 nothing quarter, I believe, right? Um, and that proved to be the difference in the game. Um, for the second week in a row, 44 was outstanding in the goal again as a freshman. Um, you know, and I just think, you know, we had great balance today. We defended, you know, we played some offense. We won the ground ball battle. You know, it was a, it was a well, it was a great team win, a well-balanced team win. Six different goal scorers, three from Mark, three from Trevor. Your offense seemed to be fluid, efficient today. You know, again, you know, Travis Sarrington went back to the, uh, he's the OC, offensive coordinator. He went back to work on Tuesday after an off day, and we had to make some whole ch wholesale changes. We made some wholesale changes and schematically, made some wholesale changes in personnel, and, um, you know, it proved to be the difference. And, you know, that, that goalie is as good a goalie as in college lacrosse, and we got 11 on him. You know, you get to double digits against Providence, you got a great chance of winning. And then finally, getting a chance to play in the renovated <laughs> Burns Stadium for the first time. Obviously, a really unbelievable day for a lot of things. It, it's a day, and in, in Bryant Lacrosse will never forget. You know, uh, David Byrne, my near and dear friend, Bryant class, Lacrosse class of '85. You know, one of our huge uh, benefactors, donors, supporters. You know, flew in for the game with his wife. Uh, it was a big deal. A bunch of, of our alums are here. Uh, recent alums, a bunch of his alums back from the '80s were here to see our president on the sideline. Our athletic director, George Bellows, here. You know, a personal friend of mine. So, just a, a great day for Bryant University. Great day for Bryant Lacrosse, and in, in a must situation in uh, in our debut in Burns Stadium.